Hey guys, welcome back to Struggleville YouTube channel. For this video, we're going to check out the Harbor Freight Black Friday sale ad for 2023. It recently leaked online. Now it's a four page ad. I perused it a little bit before starting the video and there's actually some pretty decent deals. So four page ad, just like their parking lot sales. We're going to go through the whole thing. Also, while you're here, make sure to check out the coupons page on my website. There's 93 currently available Harbor Freight coupons, and we keep that page updated constantly. We also have a separate page for parking lot sales, so you can always get those ads before everyone else. And if you sign up for the email list right here, you'll be the first to know when either of those pages are updated. Our first deal worth talking about is the top left there, the five drawer mechanic cart. So that thing's incredibly popular. People really love it. I bought mine several years ago. Now, back in the day, like when I got mine, because I'm a lucky son of a bitch, I paid $149.99. Now, $189.99 is pretty good considering where it's been. We've seen coupons for $240, $250. So to get down to $189.99, I really just don't see it ever getting lower than that again. It has really nice slides on it, nice and smooth. So I've had mine for several years. It's worked out really well. Totally recommend that. We got the Badland 3-ton off-road jack. You have the monster tires for, I guess, going mudding. Now, the only thing I don't understand about it is if you need tires like that to get to the location to jack up your vehicle, how much do we trust how solid that is below the jack to hold the vehicle? I don't know. And then we got the Badland 12,000-pound winch down to $279.99. Not a bad price. And people really like these Badland winches. Even people who don't like Harbor Freight seem to all agree that the Badland winches are pretty good. We have the Hercules 12-inch dual bevel sliding miter saw down to $299.99. Somewhat recently, Harbor Freight extended their warranties on a lot of their upper-end brands from 90 days or whatever the joke of a warranty it was now, or then. I think now it's five years or several years, whatever it is, but it's a lot better than it used to be. The little full-motion TV wall mount, $27.99 is not a great price. We see promo codes for these all the time on Amazon, and I post those on the Tech Deals page on the website. So you can get a better deal than that almost any time of the year if you need one. We have the Hercules. You buy a kit, get a battery for free. It's a two, two and a half amp hour battery is your free item. So it's not the greatest uh, battery in the world. But $97.99 for a full kit on an impact driver or a drill isn't too bad. Hercules is what Harbor Freights considers their top of the line brand. Uh, we will have another one for Bauer coming up on another page. $94.99 for this three ton Low profile floor jack. It's actually a pretty good deal. If you're in the need of just a regular jack and you don't need the off-road version, I actually really like that deal at $94.99. Got a couple of the welders on sale, the titanium easy flux 125. A couple of air compressors, $349.99 on either of those, but I just feel like they're not as important as they used to be 20 years ago you needed an air compressor in the garage now so many things are battery powered good deal on the five mil nitrile gloves this is the hundred pack if you remember a couple couple years ago when everything went crazy they wanted 16 dollars for a box of these gloves and really when we see coupons on these they get down to 5.99 sometimes you see 4.99 even though it's only a few cents more 486 i think is the lowest i have ever seen them so definitely pick those up you can always use gloves around the garage home whatever you're doing 188 on the zip ties not a bad deal there the bunker hill ammo boxes these things are actually pretty useful and 294 is a decent price i bolted one of these to the back of my riding lawnmower and i keep just like a knife and gloves and a couple of like pliers tools just so if i'm out in the yard somewhere and need something quick uh, i can get to them there Ratchet straps for $6.98, man, okay, not too crazy about that one. These drill bits here, when Harbor Freight does their $5 tool sale, they usually include this drill bit set. So if you don't need it right away, you can definitely get it cheaper, but $9.86, that's not a bad price. Uh, I got the wrench set for $5.88. The magnetic toolbar is actually pretty useful, but we used to get that for free all the time. I don't know about you, if you've been a longtime Harbor Freight shopper, you might have a stack of those like I do. 72 inch for those who really need a big boy down to $14.99 on the U.S. General. 
$2.99 for the Yukon with the full bank of drawers. My version is the cabinet one. I paid $1.79, but that was a while ago, and it doesn't have all those drawers, which add a lot of a value. The Daytona 3-ton heavy-duty ratcheting jack stands pretty good value at $27.99 to get the 3-ton set. Hopefully they fix the whole falling and crushing people's heads problem. You got the gold ratchet. Please don't buy that gold ratchet. Come on now. That's overpriced and stupid. Please don't buy it. Not even as a joke. Don't encourage them to do more stupid things like that. A couple of these little mechanic sets. I'm not a big fan of these Pittsburgh just basic tools. I mean, maybe they get you by just doing some regular homeowner stuff, but uh, you could do better. Do better. Strive in your life to do better. We got the liquidation sale. So this is just like the parking lot sales where they have the orange tag stuff. They'll have tables out somewhere. I'm assuming they're going to do it the same way for Black Friday since they're using the same banner. You can actually get some pretty good deals. You're not going to get the full warranty on things. So you definitely want to check to make sure everything is good to go. Preferably before you buy it, but definitely within, it's like a three or five day return window you have on that stuff. So good things can be had, but definitely check it out. Make sure you have, it's complete and it works. Foldable shop crane. Boy, if I had more room in the garage, I would love that. That'd be so useful. Low profile creeper. I love it when it's low profile because I'm round and low to the ground. Can't get under the car though. Need a low profile. Got the double jointed brawn. I think they actually clearanced out the original brawn, did they not? I feel like I saw it on clearance. So $19.99 for this one. What I like about it is you got both joints so it can fold all the way in on itself or it can fold all the way back. And as far as I know, that's the only difference between this and the original. But $19.99, pretty decent deal if you could use it. 5500 lumen, four foot linkable LED hanging shop light for $17.99. That's a pretty decent deal as well. If you remember, the original Braun shop light was not linkable, and I yelled at Harbor Freight every day about that. And then, boom, linkable one comes out. So it's probably a lot of people wanting that, but I'm going to pretend like it was just my, my whining that got to them and decided to change it. You got the flag that's always on sale. Unfortunately, they never do their Betsy Ross made in the USA one. It's never on sale. You can only get the China made American flag. You got that Badland 12,000. This is the synthetic rope with the wireless remote. This one's up to 529. 249 for the 400 watt peak output 290 watt hour portable power station this is another one we see a ton of deals on amazon and you can get a lot better pricing than that so it's not something i would uh, run out to the black friday ad to get this battery charger i've had for a couple of years works really well i only paid 99.99 for it two three years ago so works good we used to get a little bit cheaper not a bad price Actually, if you have those, I don't know if they're in this ad, those little V hangers, the wall mount hangers, uh, I have mine hanging on one of those, and it works just fine. It's over their weight limit, but uh, seems to be okay. A little pressure washer, $69.99 is actually a pretty good deal for it. It doesn't look like we have any storage, really, other than just a little wrap for the cord. I really like when they have a reel built in, but at least it has wheels, so you're not carrying it around. We're down to the typical sale price for the pole saw. For a while, this went up to a $59.99 sale price. Uh, if you don't mind being tethered to the cord, it actually has plenty of power, and it's a pretty good tool. It's got a little collar here that you can loosen up so you can extend it or bring it back. And I really like mine. Other than the cord, I've gone on to cordless versions. I have both the Milwaukee and the DeWalt, so I like those better because they're cordless. But while I used this, I never had a problem with it. Chipper Shredder, another one that I have and works really well. Pretty much anything you can fit in this chute, it'll chew up and just eat the hell out of it. Now it is $100 more than what I paid, so again, another item that has gone up pretty drastically. $4.99 for a 10-pack of electrical tape. I've never used their electrical tape, but if it's any, if it's decent at all, $0.50 cents a roll is a pretty good deal. $3.96 on the folding knife, eh, whatever, we can do better than that. The heat gun here, we have seen it cheaper. Like, sometimes you can get it for $7.99. It might be one that's also in the $5 tool sale. I kind of feel like it is. They only do that once or twice a year, so it depends how long you want to wait. But I've had mine for ever i bet 10 years i've had my heat gun and i used to use it daily don't anymore but it still works 
It does make some odd noises once in a while, but it still works. So here's your Braun, Ver, Braun, Bauer version of the Hercules sale that we saw earlier. You buy the kit, you get a free one and a half amp hour battery here. So it's not as good of a battery as you're getting before. But these kit prices really aren't bad. $59.99 for a full kit for a drill or an impact driver. $10 more for the hammer drill. And then getting an extra free battery. That's actually pretty decent if you're in Bowers lineup or if you want to be in Bowers lineup. $54.99 just seems too much for a Bauer rolling toolbox. Every tool brand in the world has their own system. Pick your favorite and go with it. If you... Uh, you know, or in a six-figure income level, you can buy Milwaukee Pack out, but everyone else picks something else. Uh, the rigid sets are actually pretty nice, and usually for Christmas, you can get a triple stack for $100. Um, the Hart Walmart version is, I believe, $75 right now for their triple stack, so we're not going to pay $55 for a Harbor Freight one box. It just doesn't make sense. Got some more air compressors. These guys used to be $39.99, branded a little bit differently, but essentially the same thing. So $10 more, $9.83, love the step bits. These aren't going to last long if you're going through some like hard steel, but light stuff or even plastic. One day I went through the garage and everything I wanted to hang up, I just had one of those chucked and was like, Rrr! not supposed to have a hole there, but it's going to have a hole now because I need to hang you and get you off the floor. <laughs> and it worked really well for that. Angle grinder, it's decent, cheapo angle grinder. One that if you kind of beat it up or something, you don't got to worry about. $14.99 is not a great price. A lot of times we can get it for $10. I believe that's another $5 item in the $5 tool sale. $19.99, you're really not going to get a reciprocating saw any cheaper than that. So if you don't mind a corded one, it's a pretty good deal for you. $149.99 for the high torque impact wrench. Boy, I wish it was the full kit. If it was the full kit, that would just be an amazing deal. But you can get, like right now, the Milwaukee High Torque. I believe it was a Home Depot deal. It was $229 with a free five. I believe that was the deal. It might have been a deal of the day. But anyway, just for context, I mean, that's a Milwaukee brushless tool with battery for a little bit more than what Harbor Freight wants for just their bear tool. Not an amazing price as far as I'm concerned. I do like the miter saw for $99.99 for someone who just needs a miter saw and isn't worried about it. It'll use it as a chop saw. Maybe do some 45s. <laughs> and then the ladder. Okay, so that's actually a good price for the ladder. It's one of those multi-position. You use an extension ladder, A-frame ladder. You can raise one side and leave the other side down. So if you're on steps or something to keep it straight for you. Now they have three coupon prices, $99.99, $109.99, and $119.99. And this is something that has been at this price for several years, so it hasn't been bit by the inflation bug yet. Only downside of these ladders is they are heavy. Them are some heavy ladders, but very useful, and it's kind of like having three ladders in one or so. That brings us to the end of the ad, guys. I will put a link down below to the ad so you can actually check out the scans all yourself. I'll also link to that coupon page because I always update that same page anytime new coupons come out. And I'll link to the parking lot sale page that's down below so you can find that. But if you join the email list, you'll be the first to know anytime any of these get released, new coupons, Black Friday, parking lot sales, all of that stuff. So thanks for watching. Make sure you give the video a like, subscribe for any subscriber, and I'll see you guys next time.